The Chiefs put together one of their best defensive performances of the season on Saturday, and at the core of that effort was Kansas City's rookie class, which came up with big play after big play throughout the game. Let's start with this sack by George Karloftis, which pushed his season total to four and a half. Here's Karloftis at the bottom of the screen and watch him quickly engage the right tackle before dipping his shoulder and crashing around the edge. Chris Jones and Frank Clark completely collapsed the middle of the pocket, leaving Seahawks quarterback Geno Smith with nowhere to go and Karloftis took care of the rest. Karloftis now has a sack in four of his last five games, and if you include his tip pass that took place on fourth down a bit earlier, he's tied for the second most among all defensive linemen with seven of those, by the way. The rookie edge rusher played a major role in a pair of critical moments on Saturday. Now, speaking of fourth downs, let's take a look at two more, beginning with this excellent open field tackle by Brian Cook that held Seattle short on fourth and four. Here's Cook. He's about 11 yards off the line of scrimmage. He sees Seahawks tight end Colby Parkinson break toward the sideline and check out Cook's closing speed on this. He's there immediately. And then watch this tackle. Parkinson has six inches of height and 40 pounds on Cook, but it didn't matter as the rookie safety executed a textbook open field tackle to end the Seahawks drive. We'll wrap up with another impressive play in the open field on fourth down, and this time it was rookie corner Trent McDuffie holding Seahawks wide receiver Laquan Treadwell just short of the sticks on fourth down and eight. This was a pretty straightforward situation. If McDuffie made the play, it's another stop on fourth down. If he didn't, and Trebwell broke free, it's probably a big play deep in Chiefs territory. McDuffie took care of business, however, and it went down as another huge stop for the Chiefs defense. This defense is super young, and there have of course been growing pains along the way at times, but Saturday's game was a great example of their collective progress as a group. We're going to need the best from each and every one of these dudes in the playoffs, and if this game was any indication, they're certainly heading in the right direction.